Sorry, the noted Kannada intellectual and writer Devanur Mahadeva has in fact asked his chapter to be withdrawn from the textbooks opposing the saffronization of the school textbooks or what he mentions saffronization of the books by the Karnataka BJP government. My colleague Neha Hebale is joining me live for more updates on this story. Neha, I believe this uh, controversy erupted after uh, in fact a speech by the RSS founder uh, was included as a lesson in the class 10 Kannada textbooks for students and a few lessons on social reformers in fact uh, were reportedly uh, you know removed and also this was a big controversy on most of the editions of uh, many uh, upper caste brahmins works being included in the textbooks and that was what really fueled fire to this entire controversy and now this particular move by devanur mahadeva is uh, really adding to the entire foundation because i believe uh, even the education minister has said that his chapter has not been removed from the textbooks Well, in fact, you know, Griha, there's been a lot of back and forth on this entire issue. Right from the time that this controversy erupted, we've been seeing how, uh, you know, there have been several allegations, counter-allegations, and the government clarifying its stand just yesterday in a press conference. Well, now, in fact, you know, we're seeing noted intellectual over here, Devanur Mahadeva, who's actually come out right now and stated that, you know, he would like for his chapter to be dropped entirely from the textbooks. Now, this is important because let's tell you that the Karnataka BJP right now is facing allegations of saffronized of textbooks. In fact, you, you rightly pointed out that this began when, uh, you know, RSS founder Hegdevard, a, uh, a part of his speech was actually included in the class 10 textbooks. And this was, in fact, you know, then again refuted by the Karnataka education minister saying that, you know, uh, the textbook committee over here, for that matter, hadn't really, you know, finalized the last copy to be printed. Now, it's important over here to note, Griha, that it's not only Hegdevard's, in fact, you know, textbook, but also several other important leaders, such such as, you know, Bhagat Singh and Periyar and also Nara and Guru. There was a lot of controversy that had erupted around all of these people's lessons also being included and dropped, respectively, from these textbooks. Now, Hello. the Karnataka, in fact, you know, education minister on his part has come out and said that the final copies of of these textbooks are yet to be printed and that the PDF copies available on the website of the textbook committee should not be referred to and allegations shouldn't be leveled against the government based on these. Now he's also further gone on to clarify that even during the time of the previous committee there were several lessons regarding uh, you know a few leaders which were dropped regarding a few uh, uh, you know important leaders which were dropped. So as far as you know this entire textbook issue is concerned uh, Griha it has really you know erupted into a huge debate over here in the state of Karnataka and the government while of course is facing charges of saffronization of textbooks the government has refuted all these charges and said that you know one will have to wait till the final textbooks are printed but uh, you know at a time like this for an intellectual to be coming out and stating that he would like to have his lessons dropped uh, you know that, that of course really goes on to make quite a big statement over here and we'll have to wait and see what comes out but again it's important here also to mention one fact that uh, you know Devanur uh, Mahadeva has been someone who even in the past you know has stood strong by his statements in the past also when he had received you know awards such as the Sahitya award and other awards as well he had gone on to return it as a mark of protest against the government